Hello everyone, welcome back to the channel. DXVK DirectX to Vulkan, which helps Windows games run on Linux through Wine or Pluton, is getting new update. The DXVK 2.7 just dropped and is bringing some serious upgrade, especially if you are using Intel's new Battle Mage GPUs or even modern AMD and Nvidia cards. This tool is one of the main reasons Linux gaming is even possible today, especially on Steam Deck or other non Windows systems. Now let's talk about what's new in version 2.7. DXVK completely rewrote the way it handled graphics in instructions, especially the descriptor binding model. Games that stress your GPUs like God of War, Watch Dogs 2, Final Fantasy will now run smoother, but only on newer AMD and Nvidia GPUs. If you are one of the few running Intel's Battle Mage discrete GPU or have Lunar Lake i GPUs, this update is great news. Memory defragmentation is now on by default, helping Unity engine games look better and shutterless. That means better VRAM uses and fewer hiccups in games. The update also introduced various fix and optimization, including better D3D shader handling and game-specific walkaround for titles like LEGO City Undercover, Astra Breed, and Test Driving Ultimate 2. The full catalog of the update is given in the description and all the sources too. So overall, if you are gaming on Linux, especially through Steam Deck or Proton, this is a huge update. It shows how fast the Linux gaming is growing. You're gonna notice a giant FPS jump, smoother gameplay, fewer crashes and better hardware capability. That's it for today. In this video, I don't use any b-rolls or a fancy thumbnail. So feedback from you guys gonna help me a lot. If you found this helpful, give me a thumbs up and hit that subscribe button for more GPU, hardware and software news like this. Thank you.